at the entrance of Vanilla. They are busy still. And they're bringing in pollen. Rocky Road, this hive is a little different. When I came first, this board was off. Um, I guess I didn't have the block secured enough to secure everything. So it was off and half the hive was exposed. But they're still okay. Um, they had an entrance there and the bees are all confused now where to go. So let's watch what's going on at the entrance here. So not as many bees leaving, coming and going as vanilla. So you see these three bees hanging out at the top here? Their entrance used to be there because that board was gone. So they're kind of like, hey, where, where is everyone? So I'm going to rearrange the box anyway. And so it'll be a new box. I'm going to give them a new box to live in. So that one found the entrance and just went in and back out again. Last bee with pollen. I hope she finds out where to go. She's just resting from her flight and then she's going to pick up and try and find her entrance because she knows this is her hive, but that was her entrance and now it's not. So let's see if she figures it out. They're figuring it out, guys. At the entrance at Mango Ice Cream, there fortunate, unfortunately is no activity at all. It's quiet. And so I don't hear anything going on inside. So pretty sure this hive is a goner. Hey guys, so here's the box and I'm going to open it. Pulled the box open, looked inside. That's what I want right there. It's my next essential oil. Thyme oil. So we're packing back up the box and putting it in the shed. So what we have here is a bottom board. We have a medium frame under the under the medium box. Sorry, I have a telescoping lid and a inner cover that's under here i'm not going to pull it up but i saw the inner cover the inner cover is under here maybe if i move this here to the inner cover yeah so the inner cover is there and uh, i lost mango and so this was going to be another hive or to fix um to fix rocky road we already fixed rocky road insulated rocky road so no this is just an extra hive box so i'm gonna put this in the shed for next season. So now Rocky Road looks like a real hive. Uh, give them a proper top cover, a proper inner cover, a proper proper entrance reducer, and a proper bottom board. And they're a little confused as you can see, like what just happened? But let me see if they're getting the point. They have two entrances, a little one at the side there and a little one at the bottom there. So a little one at the side here and a little one at the bottom here. And I'll see if they get the point. It's a small cluster of bees. It's only two frames, two frame cluster of bees in there. So I am going to make them as warm as possible now to put the insulation around them. and. Hopefully they do well. I found brood in there while I was trying to put together everything. So hopefully they do okay. Okay, so for the foam that goes in the inner cover, I measured the 
and measured and marked the outer lining of the medium frame and it fits perfectly in there so just kind of go along the outside mark cut and it fits on the inside of this perfectly look like a glove like a glove i also need one for the inner cover just fit within here that one's a little less precise i actually have to measure this one so i'm using the leftover piece from the cut that i did with the inner cover this piece is the leftover piece i'm just going to cut it there and then fit it there and then cut it to size so i played with it to work so just cutting it and adjusting it cutting it adjusting it playing with it and then to fit this piece here um, just extra strips as well so now that i have that piece placed on the inner cover and another piece placed on the inside of the top cover i'm just gonna fit them back together so now i'm gonna work on the wrap so i'm gonna wrap this side the back side and the other side the other side i'm not gonna do the front until i come back next time so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to mark there mark there and then cut along my marks to have a piece in line with that box and i'm going to do that for each side that side this side and the back side i said back side so now that i've measured and cut everything i'm just going to use a duct tape to put it just tape it all together Put the top cover on okay so when i reveal uh, you take a look down and see right so they haven't done they haven't done that frame yet but they've done this frame uh, so number one frame number two frame number three frame number four frame number five frame number six frame Number seven frame not done. Number eight frame not done. Okay, but they're working on it. So I tidied things up a bit. Uh, moved the storage area for the frames to there. I uh, neatened up the weed cloth. Um, these guys are quiet. They're inside. There's no activity in the hive right now. But they're insulated with Mr upside down pink panther <laughs> so foam board insulation awesome so they're quiet and i think they should be okay for tonight tonight's going to be rather cold so we'll see if we have bees when we get back so as you can see i added a thermometer so i knew what know what the temperature is so right now as you can see it's like that thing 12 i'm shaking about 12. Yeah, that's about 12. No, 12. 14. It's 14 degrees right now. Sun's going down. And it has been like that temperature all day. So I put out a little feeder. It's probably probably too late. It just has red food coloring in there. I don't know, maybe in the spring I'll figure out if they still have red food left or not. <laughs> I don't know, it's just uh, just something I thought of. I don't even know if it's going to work. All is well at the entrance. The traffic jam has ceased. Let me just walk you around. So, everything quiet at the entrance. People still going and coming there. Last, last call, guys. <laughs> it's dinner time. So, I wrapped it. I'll wait at the back, at the back here. Going on the side and the front and the front is is uh empty now i'm going to check the bottom board for mites okay so there's one so i've seen like five of them now just kind of zoom back in on him i think that's one and i've counted about five of them now no worries it's just baby spiders <laughs> 